on guys, today we're going to play the HTC Vive again. <laughs> I like doing just the HTC Vive because you just want to wave your hands around the whole time. But we're going to be playing the solar system today, which I believe is this one. This one, that, I just, that looks like a dead guy. So in this one, actually there we go, the solar system. What is going on with my hand? Um, so Relic admits a portrayal of the solar system with all planets in their correct relative scale. Comets and relative orbital distances. You probably don't want to walk that far. Experiment Kepler so, Mason has been safely distracted. So we are going to be doing. Oh, did I get turned around? Oh my gosh, this way is fraught, boy. <laughs> See what I'm talking about? Oh, now this controller is way off. Ah, uh, guys, this is like going through my head right now. How does that work? Whoa! Oh my gosh! This is awesome! Is that Pluto over there? Oh, it's Neptune! Where's Pluto? Guys, did you not make Pluto a planet? I didn't got completely turned around. Which way is forward? Pluto is totally a planet. I don't care what you say, Pluto is a planet. I grew up with Pluto being a planet. This is Saturn. Oh my gosh, I am blowing up the world. I have Saturn. So what happens if I like... Does it go back to normal? Oh no. Hold on, can I like mess up the world? Where's Neptune? So does that like mess up everything? Okay. So this one is your anus or my anus, however you want to say it. Okay. So there's which way am I even facing? <laughs> I guess it turned around. So here's Jupiter. Oh, oh God! It's white inside. <laughs> ah. Okay. Jupiter, put back. All right. So there's one right there. What is that? That's Earth! Guys, we are really, really small. Where'd you go? Come here, Earth. Guys, can you imagine? Okay, so... We are... Oh, is that upside down? Where are we at? I can't really see. I think... Yeah, that's us right there. So, we are right there. <laughs> and we are... Looking at ourselves, looking at ourselves, looking at ourselves. Whoa, can you throw? Where did Earth go? Oh! We need to put Earth back, because... Where are you? You're Mars. There you go. Whoa, Mercury is rolling. Well, Venus has got to be around here somewhere. Yeah, here he comes. Yeah, it's awesome. All right, now. Oh, God, it's so hot. Ah! Oh, it's, it's, it's so, like, real. I feel like I'm about to like stick my head in water. There's a center of the earth. It's really loud in there. This is so cool. I love, and I guess this is the asteroid belt. Can I like touch these? No. So, I'm not facing the front, am I? I completely like lost everything. So this is Neptune again. Eh. That's awesome. Alright, we're gonna fix this. Oh, I hit the wall again. I'm the cord is getting wrapped around my feet. No, Saturn! Get back in your orbit! 
Okay, guys. I think this one's gonna be it. This is really cool. I like that you can, like, pick them up. <laughs> I don't know where the wall's at. <laughs> that is so cool. That is the best thing about VR so far, is that you can throw something up and then catch it. <laughs> that is awesome. Well, I'm completely, I'm facing the wrong way again. This has been, I know we're not looking at, hold on, let's go over there. There we go. Guys, this has been the solar system in the lab. This was so cool. I love that, you know, you can literally just like, you know, walk around in, in space. I mean, I, I, once again, I talk to people all the time about playing VR stuff. It's another thing to watch someone play it and show off what it can do. But when you actually get in there and experience it and play it and you can touch it and you can, you know, you have your controllers, it's something so surreal. But anyway, guys, this has been The Lab Solar System. Thanks for watching. My name is Schaefer Games, and as always, keep on.